Hey guys, welcome to Fur Tutorials. Guys, today I teach you how to create realistic material with using bump map, diffuse, and normal map. So, guys, let's start it. So, firstly, guys, I take cube and change cube size smaller 100, 100, and 100. And I go to display, select our shading lines. Guys, fill it, check, and radius, I take 4 cm and subdivided I take 10 create more smoothness right guys I show you my textures guys see this is my all textures right open see this is my bump map diffuse normal map and this is my reflection I show you how to apply all textures so guys this is my metal texture I show you how to create realistic material so select and position 50 guys I go to create and new material open go on color guys I create metal texture so go on desktop yeah this is my metal select apply diffuse and open and no right go on reflection Guys, go to default specular and apply this one. This is my reflection and open and no. Guys, change this brightness little bit. Take like, guys, 100 is better. Again, guys, go on layer, add and take reflection legacy. Yes. And guys, roughness, I take 30. And I go to... Here brightness I take 10 and go on texture and use fractional and guys make strength again take 10 that's it and I go to this time bump bump map check guys this is my bump map and open and no you can change guys strength is depend on your work so 20 is good and I go to lastly normal map and guys see this is my normal map and open and no right see this is my realistic metal texture so close apply on here yes see guys right and now change guys UV so select this material and length you 50% and 50% and protection you can take cubic right see guys it's really realistic so render preview see right okay now guys I apply stone texture so this time I take spare and radius like 50 and up guys you can increase segments increase like 50 is good guys I create stone texture so go on create and new open color go on back guys see this is my stone texture so select diffuse and open and no go on reflection diffuse and apply this time specular and open and no so guys now go on bump select and this is my bump and no right guys so close and apply guys same again change UV I take spherical and length little bit decrease yes so render preview see guys this is my stone realistic texture right so close and guys this time I take cylinder go on back and up yeah okay guys I create wall texture so apply on here create and new open color go on back guys this is my brick texture see right so select this one 
diffuse and no go on reflection default specular guys this time i apply this one this is my specular reflection and open and no go to bump map this is my guys bump map and apply go to normal map select and apply and no right guys this is my displacement you can apply this texture this is my roughness and no and strength i take only 10 cm actually 10% so close and apply right guys see this really realistic render preview right it's really good okay after that guys i create wood texture so again this time i take cone and make smaller attach on flow yes guys i create realistic wood texture again create new material open and color go on back go on here see this my wood and open and no go to reflection default specular and apply this one this actually this one is specular and open and no go on bump this my displacer and lastly normal map and create like this right so close and apply guys see you can change only uv so select like 30 and like 75 50 yes great and change this uv not cubic spherical i take only uv map yeah right and lastly guys so spare go on back and make smaller like 75 percent yes and guys create stone texture again color go on back guys this time i take like brown dirty not this yeah this one so select color and apply go on reflection default specular this my this one specular and open and no go on bump guys see this is my bump map and open and no normal map select and open and no right and lastly displacer you can apply it's this one it's not necessary this one and strength i take only 10 percent right so close and apply and guys spherical only change uv yes right it's really realistic render preview yeah this really depth so select this one not this yes guys only change uv land yes right okay now guys i use my cinema 4d studio light merge select and open and set camera angle camera angle like this here okay set light yes again go on camera guys go on render setting i take best render setting so ambient occlusion maximum sample 1 to 8 accuracy take 100% and 
global illumination i take high anti select best that's it so i show you guys my render go on here and render preview See guys, this is my realistic render, right? You can take some color correction. Go on filter. Saturation I take 20, contrast take 10. Yes. Right guys? So guys, you can download all texture and my project file from my website. It's free. So thank you for watching.